good evening. I have got to keep this one short because we are getting ready to have a webinar. All right, so I want to tell you the story it happened to me today. Um, but I want to tell you, first of all, I love weenie dogs. Okay, in fact, when I got Abby the Labby, who's down there in the floor asleep on me right now, I was actually, don't tell her this, but I was looking for a weenie dog. Okay. And I was kind of hoping to find an old weenie dog so I wouldn't have a really long-term commitment. All right. But Abby the Labby showed up and I love her. She's the ugly Dotson. And actually this past December for Christmas, I was hoping that Santa was going to bring me a Dotson and he didn't, but that's okay. Uh, there's always next year. And so I, anytime my friends have a Dodson, there's a Winnie dog in the store, like I just go bonkers. I love Winnie dogs. So if you follow me on Instagram at Whitney Buys Houses, then you know that Harrison, my youngest stepson and I, went driving for dollars today after school. All right. And we're out driving for dollars and we're driving down the four lane and there's a Walmart and people are stopped at the red light to come out of Walmart and there's this guy in a pickup truck and he's got this weenie dog like trying to come out the window and I told Harrison Harrison was on the phone with his dad and I was like oh did you see the weenie dog did you see the weenie dog and he was like yeah I did so as I come up to the next red light I stopped kinda back before the red light so this guy with the pickup he came by and I rolled down Harrison's window and, you know, I'm looking out the window, pretty obvious looking out the window and, like, flagging the guy down. So he comes up to the red light, and he's going slow, and he kind of looks in my window like, what are you looking at? So he goes on up to the red light, and then I creep up on him, and I get right beside him, and y'all, I've got the window down, Harrison's on the phone with his dad, and I, I see this guy has an Alabama tag, and we're pretty close to Alabama, so that's not a big deal, but... Out the window of the car in front of Walmart, I yell, Where's your weenie? <laughs> I'm just yelling, Where, Hey man, where's your weenie? <laughs> and without missing a beat, I mean, he almost spit his McDonald's out. But without missing a beat, this guy's driving this pickup, and he's this big old kind of burly guy. Kind of looks like my dad, and he goes, he like points at his wiener dog. And uh, at that time, the weenie dog pops his, he pops his head up, and he was like, hi. <laughs> oh, it was so funny. Harrison looked at me like, did you just ask where his weenie is? And I could hear Jason on the phone saying, what did she just say? <laughs> so if you have a wiener dog, a Dotson, and you pull up next to me at a red light, I'm going to ask to see your weenie. <laughs> and I mean your dog. Not anything else. So I just had to tell you that story. Because I thought it was hilarious. Harrison was completely embarrassed. And Jason's totally confused. <laughs> but when you're driving for dollars, you never know what kind of experience you'll have. Or adventure you'll have. So go out driving for dollars. But make sure you have like a backup plan for that. Because driving for dollars by itself is a complete waste of time. While Harrison and I were out, we put an offer in on a lot. And the woman must be smoking crack because she ain't never going to get that much for that lot. But... We made an offer. We tried. So, um, I also want to let you know one last time I'm having a webinar in about 30 minutes. I've actually got to go get myself situated and ready for the webinar. So, I'm going to let you go. But I'll drop the link in here. And if you want to sign up for it, it is going to be at 7. You can come in late and you can catch the replay, but only if you register. So, let me know that you're ready and let me know if you enjoyed my Alabama wiener story. <laughs> Bye, y'all.